Hey guys, Lissa here, and today I'm going to talk to you guys about an upcoming event that I'm so excited to be participating in. Uh, if you've known about me for a while, you probably know that I competed in WSOE last December. I took third place, uh, first place being Gia. She is a caster in uh, the Asian Pacific area, and second place being Songbird Cora. Uh, I unfortunately didn't get first or second, got the third, which is pretty good, out of 16 invited players. And today it has been announced that there is a return event, so I'm going to show you guys that trailer. <laughs> no one saw her coming. It's Gia. They said... A caster can't play the game. Oh, casters are pretty freaking good. She's no match for the pros. She's a huge match, man. <laughs> Pick the caster to win it all? I would, yeah. Crazy. Not crazy. <laughs> She'll never make it to the final match. Gia's got some serious skills. Gia finishes oh, me. off the slip. No! Don't so beat me! In the world. That's how Gia I got third. <laughs> she's been a caster, and now she's a champion. Ladies and gentlemen, the champion. The WSOE Go, Gia. Showdown. It is Gia. <laughs> the champion. If that was crazy, get ready for what comes next. Vegas! Woo! <laughs> WSOE 5, the return of Gia. Yay! So, the return of Gia. This is the new upcoming event for WSOE. Uh, so this event is going to be way different than any other event you've seen in Hearthstone before. Uh, typically in a Hearthstone event, you guys either see Swiss or double elimination brackets, stuff like that. Uh, this is a small event where four competitors are coming back from the last competition to battle it out and uh those four competitors will be doing a double elimination bracket, and the winner of that double elimination bracket will get to face off first Gia in a title defense, basically. Uh, Gia is automatically in the championship game, and us four are battling it out to try and take her title away from her. Really cool event, because that just hasn't been seen or done before in Hearthstone, so I'm really excited. Uh, let's talk about who got the invites. Uh, these are the four of us who will be competing versus Gia. Uh, first off is Songbird Cora. Songbird Cora took second place to Gia in the tournament. Uh, next is Patra and I. Patra and I both placed third place in the tournament. Um, Patra had lost to Songbird Cora. I had lost to Gia. Don't look at that photo of me. I kind of hate it. Let me just, you know. All right, that's me. And uh, last is Ali Straza. Ali Straza took top eight. Unfortunately, uh, I swept her because I had Duskbreaker on four every turn. And she's one of my best friends, so I'm so excited that she has been invited back as well. So us four will be competing to uh, face off. We'll be doing, okay, so <laughs> let me explain this. Saturday, uh, March 30th will be a double elimination bracket where us four will face off versus each other and the winner of the double elimination bracket will play Gia on Sunday. Uh, also on Sunday will be show matches between the bottom three people and those show matches will determine how much money you make off uh, the event. So for each show match you win, you can make uh, up to 2.5k and... Um, also, the winner of the whole thing gets 15K. Second place gets 5K. Really awesome event. There are also bounties. There are three different bounties, if I am not mistaken. Let me go pull those up real fast for you guys. Uh, I just read about them. Hold on. I didn't win any bounties last time. But these next ones, I think, are... Are, aren't as hard to win. Uh, so the bounties this time are, um, wait, 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 reading, reading. Uh, oh no, where'd it go? Okay, here it is. Um, most consecutive wins, most game one wins, and most reverse sweeps. So those are the three bounties you can win each for $2,000. Um, 
so just really fun event with cool different initiatives and stuff. Uh, I'm so excited. It's going to be in Vegas next week. Also, let's talk about the format of the event. Last WSOE, there was, it was a nine deck format. So normally when you go to a competition, you have four decks and your opponent bans one. This last time it was nine decks and it was a pick ban phase where you ban two, pick one, ban two, pick one, ban one, pick one. Uh, this time it's a little different and it's actually kind of spicy. We have a seven deck lineup where we bring seven different decks. So we, there's two heroes we do not have to touch, but they have to be, uh, all seven decks have to be from a different hero. And then next, um, w the nice little spicy thing is that we cannot use cards that are leaving for the Hall of Fame. So the cards leaving for Hall of Fame are Naturalize, Doom Guard, uh, <laughs> Divine Favor, Baku Gen, and all the cards that go with Baku Gen, those odd even cards. Yeah. So these seven decks we're bringing cannot be Baku Gen decks, which is kind of a big deal. And no Naturalize, so like Druid's kind of screwed a little bit, unless you bring Spiteful maybe. But uh, yeah, it's going to be a really interesting event. If you've been a little bit bored with the meta, this will definitely spice it up. Um, and again, it's, it's a whole new format that we've just never seen in Hearthstone. So I think it's going to be really exciting, really fun. I really hope that you guys watch. Um, so if you watch my streams normally, I will not be in town this coming week. I have to fly out to Vegas on Wednesday. Um, and then we start the competition on Saturday. So make sure you turn, tune in to Twitch WSOE on Saturday morning to watch everything live. It's going to be amazing. Cheer me on. Cheer on my friends. I mean, I'm friends with all of them, so it's like hard to say who to cheer for. But yeah, I just hope to see you guys there and wish me luck. Thanks. Bye, guys.